the king of Land's End. Oh, never mind, he did. Or not? You didn't become the new Blighted Evil? Ruler of all Blighted? King, or Knight Captain Julius. King Knight. <laughs> King Knight's a different video game. And a pretty good one at that. Okay. So if you're just gonna keep lunging at me, do I just lunge every time you do glowy eyes? Okay. Okay. I see glowy eyes. Night Captain. What if I do this? Oh, you dodge it, okay. Stand in the cloud! Oh, not them. Like, enemies not being able to drop their block the cloud is why we still use the cloud. You have a million health, dude. I'm hitting you for two hundo damage. Kya! Two hundo damage, and they're like barely moving. Oh, is that a? I was just them. Okay, I, I was okay. I, okay, so I was kind of thinking. That there was going to be, like, a, a command mail wave I was going to have to jump over or something. They just, like, bull rushed me. And destroyed the entire screen in the process. Ah, stop staying inside of me. That does look like... Is it faster damage? I mean, it might be a little safer, but they have a gap closer, like, no tomorrow. Dude, 200 damage barely moves them. Whoa. That worked out a lot better. Hundo 90. That actually does less damage than our auto attacks. It's just safer and a little more AoE, probably. Yeah, them blocking that is very inconvenient, especially with how much damage. With how much damage they do and how little they take. Charge through... No, I can't. It doesn't... It takes too long to use. Can't even hit him from behind. All right, then. My... I should probably change my relics for an actual boss setup. I don't know why I didn't change our relics. We have the dumbest relics. All right. We have already lost two of our... Can you do that? Okay, you can actually just outrange that. Oh, that was cool. I thought that the purple bar underneath them was when they when they did the next phase. Alright, so you definitely want to dash through that. And then do big damage. We got them to the, the, the decay and canite. Aw, oh, they dodged it. They're masters of, of agility. All right, so you want to get away from them when they do that. So do the do the do the dash. You do. We go through that, and then we get away because they're gonna blow up. Yeah, just that with with, with less being inside of them and getting hit. Oh wow, there's not really much time on that. Is that just supposed to stop you from punishing them like at all? Yeah, there's there's very little. If, you, if you've done anything, then you're stuck in an animation and you can't do anything about that. Oof. Maybe this is where we need more range? Dude, even when they're attacking, they don't, they don't take damage. What is this block window? Alright. Hit and then run away. Or perhaps I should just run away and then... Just shoot them the whole time they do that. Okay, I did not have the timing on that. I did have the dying on the dead, though. Hey, we dodged it! Now turn around and kill me real quick. Skrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
We got more healing potency for when we do heal. And we have more spirit uses. Oh, it looks like it's only two for most ability. I wish that hit, dude. I should I should get like the dog or something. Would you also block doggo? Like this, despite the crazy health they have, if they didn't block like 910% of all attacks, it would be fine. Like projectiles and stuff, whatever, that's fine. But when I'm up in your face and I'm hitting you with sword, you should be respecting sword. Like, even when they're mid-attack. Alright, I mean, we're actually hitting them now. Like, what are those? What are these? Oh, I thought we were gonna push them. I was, I was aggressive. Aw, oh, jeez. I cannot jump over that. It has to be rolled through. Dude, you can build up most of another attack if they if they go down like that. Whoosh. You need to do the thing. Whoa. I there's not enough of a tell on that. And then they're gonna whoosh. But I can shoot them while they do that. Oh god. If you stay close to them when he's gonna do that, you could just get to the other side of him, actually. I hate that attack. If they just didn't have that attack, I would get hit, like, half as often. Alright. I mean, I'd still die. Like, 100% we would still lose. But we would lose less. Yes! I, if I did the pillars... I was fairly confident. Two hits and then dash. You do the thing? You need, No? doing? Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Oh, too soon. Executives, too soon. Whoosh. I went for three hits instead of two and then dodge. My, like, if I, if I get a big dodge, brain turns off. Whoa, what are you? Kamehameha wave! Alright, I can hit you from here! Or you could just do that, never mind. I'm just gonna die. This is gonna be a case of get good and stop getting hit by the dumb attacks. We have five big heals. And I still ran out of healing. Maybe we use these earlier on? I don't know, dude. Like, this seems to reliably hit, and we have 42 of these, which definitely, definitely is not enough to kill boss. Even if every last one of these lands, it is not enough to kill boss. But they also seem to have a harder time blocking from behind. And if every one of these hits, that would be nice. The change of pace, it would be great. No, maybe save these for the harder phase? I don't know. Yeah, that, that's so hard to hit with. It's just not optimal for this boss in particular. They basically have to be dashing or in the middle of an attack already. Skidoosh. It's like they block everything, dude. Could drop an actual meteor on them, still take damage. Or I would take the damage, they would take none. Alright. Cool beans. Get hit. I need you to be more offensive. And stop blocking. Don't you just want to punch me in the face? Don't I have, like, the most face-punchable face? Every response is measured. 
Stop having discipline and being a knight captain. Oh, I'm glad that there's such a big dodge window on that. I wish there was a big dodge window on that. Oh, wait. We missed good attacking times. Hammer not, not optimal on this either. Whoosh. One, two, row. Dang it. All right. What if I shoot you in the... Oh, you stabbed me. Okay. I was like, what if I shoot you in the face? And then and then there was just immediate reprisal. They were like, you, you messed up. Why did you think that that was going to work? Explosion! Oh, no, wait. He was doing the thing. Dang it, dude. Stop outplaying me. Oh, that was just an instant full health dead. You can't jump over it. All right, you have to get behind them. All right. What if we did the same thing, but we had Doggo? Actually, I probably should have gotten rid of the hammer. Instead of my ranged, it's whatever, it's fine. Doggo, you will commence damage, and I will do dodge. Teamwork. Be better than the Raven. Quick, Doggo, do Doggo things. Super friends. I wonder if there's three pets and you could just have them fight for you. Well, that does seem like it was a lot faster. You gonna boosh me away? Nope. I also lost the projectile one that hits more often. I mean, it is only like two hits, but... That's a lot better than them taking one jump back and then dodging the whole thing. Time for healing. What is even happening right now? Time for healing. Normally I like it when they do the dash, but normally it's easier to dodge. Ah, oh, dude, we keep stopping inside them. Let's go. Get hit, please! Still taking damage from that. No! It let me cancel it, cool! Yeah, now you did the thing. Okay, I have to stay right next to you because Kamehameha. That is the counterplay. It's just don't don't be in front of them. If you're in front of them, it was nice knowing you, dude. Doggo is donezo. Oh, are those 200 and... That's pretty good. Let me heal. How do you still deny me? Dude, even up there, it didn't even touch me. You have to dash through it? Him backing up into me is just the most lame. Dude. Little did he know I brought the whole squad. You thought I was alone? 3v1. Honorable combat. For honor. He's probably going to block the bird, like, entirely, now that I think about it, because bird is projectile. Dog's only heading because dog's flurrying back and forth. That's okay, we're making an attempt. God, we're failing. But an attempt is being made. Yeah, that actually looks like it hits for full damage. I kept thinking he was hitting for 28, but it was hitting for 228. I think our base attack is just best for ultimate limit break. Okay.
Oops. Aw, oh, dude, lame. I was... I, I didn't put it up enough. I wanted to try and do that to dodge it. Which does work. I just did it wrong. Let's go, you guys. Did they block that whole super? I didn't know supers could be blocked. Okay, you're gonna do the thing. I'm gonna heal over here. I'm about to run out of stuff. Is that the instantly kills you and then we die and then there's no counterplay? Okay. Alright, we're going for the multi-hits. I wish I did not take damages for being, like, in skin contact with you. Doggo will do things, we'll drop the axe behind them, and we'll do melee attacks. With any luck, we'll break guards and stagger them and do big tricksy hobbits things. You can actually interrupt his attack if I dash behind him too soon. Or maybe it's because me and Doggo both hitting at the same time. He just doesn't know how to handle it. I wish Doggo didn't run out. Doggo, why do you abandon me when I need you most? The dogs are supposed to be faithful. Plus. Give me big damage. Skadoosh. But what about Skadoosh? I, I totally rolled through that. I'm just saying. That one I didn't. But what if we poison them while we axe them with a sword? I, all right, they just kind of jump out of it, huh? I'm just like, they can't block it. This is kind of my, my thing. And they, they do a lot of that blocking thing. Yeah, Doggo, Doggo probably hits and does more damage than them. Actually, one cloud hits multiple times. So, so probably more damage overall, actually. When they dodge, I feel it in my soul. And it feels bad, man. I wonder if this is a later game boss. It can't be, right? There's nowhere else for us to go. It's just kind of remarkable to me how little damage we do. Do we have the... the ground attack spring on? We should. There we go. No freebies? Hey, we dodged that attack. Even two is too much for that. It's like the chip damage. You just hit one and then run. Wow, I even ran away and then went back in and it still hit me. I mean, thankfully the damage on that attack is particularly low. Oh, you were staggered. Dang it. The damage! Stop turning around so fast! This guy's a jerk. Oh, Julius, right, Julius was the one that we read all those notes from. We do more damage while we're on the ground. I swapped out the relic. I should've used the other ability. It's less damage, but it would've guaranteed hits. Does Doggo build up my meter? I can't tell. Doggo does build up meter. I should have used that other ability I just talked about using, but uh, I just default to the X button. Plus. 
That was honestly one of the main reasons I put that on there. The axe was kind of hard to use. Or rather, not really super worth to use. That actually did damage to me. He was just... I thought that just pushed me away. Dang it, you actually... Uh... Yo, those were 500 each. That's definitely more damage. I gotta just get, like, right on top of the dude and then use that every time. Use it! Yeah, I'm gonna just, uh, try and get on the other side of you when you do that. Wait, oh no, wait, we, it was a stagger! Alright, you're gonna do scary things. I'll blow a heal just in case I'm at full health. You're gonna back up? Okay. We can't just keep attacking because he'll push back into us. There's too much knockback on that or whatever, and he sends himself back into oblivion. Yeah. That stagger after he's done? Bane of my existence. Whoosh! Only one hit. Panic heal. Fall to your knees! We finish it! Please, we finish it! Please! Ooh. I'm sorry, I've only added to your burdens. No kidding, dude! I mean, we only died like seven times. I I'm kind of blowing it out of proportions. It's not a bad fight. The block windows and stuff kind of crazy, though. But permissible. Everything is fine. As the kingdom approached oblivion, its subjects became deathless abominations. My brethren fought on until madness consumed them, or the rain did. I managed to stave off the corruption of my mind and found myself in the throne room. My blade held over the king I was meant to protect. He shook and blubbered in exasperation. The priestess and knights who gave their lives for the kingdom were disposable. This was where the king's obsession with immortality had led us. The king's words dripping with greed were the palpable lament of his corrupt heart. It was plain to me as the blood pumping in that heart also flowed through my veins. I too had not fought to protect the kingdom or its people, but my own interests. I only wished for him to admit he had been wrong to abandon me. Sure enough, as I held my sword over him, his eyes were fixed only on me. I had been waiting for this, waiting for our eyes to meet for the very first time. That's right, Julius was the illegitimate son born into the family of those executioners, if I remember right. Knight Captain Julius unleashes a series of jabbing attacks with a lance that allows for maximum reach. Advancing thrusts can be made by using the skill while moving sideways. The king's bastard son, after enduring a hard life, he rose through the knightly ranks to get back at his father. His tenacity is unparalleled. Crystal Dash. After dodging, Knight Julius or Knight Captain Julius grabs hold of you and charges forward, allowing a burst of momentum. That's kind of fancy. Piercing Spectral Lance. Wall dashing attack button. The charging strike of Knight Captain Julius's lance can break through pestilent or pustulant walls. The longer the dash, the more magic builds up within the spear. This not only increases attack range and attack pa er, and power, but also powers through thicker pustulant walls. So we just hold it. A knight driven from his castle. How much hatred must one be consumed by to kill one's own kin? I mean, it sounds like he had it coming. He basically saved the kingdom. We're so much faster! 
There's definitely more up here. We're so much faster. This is the mobility I wanted. Achievement unlocked. Impaling Lily. Did that happen when we left the room or when I used that ability specifically? Either way, we have 10 trillion more. I gotta, I gotta set back our stuff. I'm gonna move our stuff back. Infinite uses. Series of jabs. What is this? So if we're moving, we inch forward. I mean, we do that with the sword as well. If we just sit here, then we don't move at all. I actually really like that. That has a really big range. And we move when we want to go sideways. I think I like that more than the hammer. More applicable. Can I charge it? No. Okay. I'm going to fix our setup. And then go to bed. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you liked it. Later, everybody.